Okay, OmniLab Media. What is it? Pause. It's a true integrated media company now. We've got a long heritage, but today we are create, service, and monetize. And I'll walk you through some case studies that outline why we can summarize create, service, and monetize. OmniLab Media has businesses that focus on those parts individually, or some of them for the whole data chain. In create, we have content and we have technology, which we then create for partners and from our media. We service. We've got content solutions, technology solutions for our partners and on our media and our clients. And we monetize, again, for, our, for content and technology through distribution and licensing for partners, on the lab and clients. Sounds a bit repetitive. Well, it is about partnerships, it is about our clients, and on the other media is now also producing those things itself as well. Graham also mentioned earlier about our people. Culture of creativity, talent, and longevity of relationships. And as Tony highlighted, when we first met, actually, back in 1999, to try and get the movie network to join back then Omnicon, which was merging with Video Lab to become uh, on that post, uh, we then finally were successful in forming that partnership in 2002, longevity of relationship. Thank you, Tony. To move into some case studies, speaking of culture and creativity and talent, no better case study than Dr. D Studios. Kennedy Miller Mitchell and Omnilab Media have joined to create that business and the vision which Dr. George and ourselves with Doug Mitchell created, which was to try and bring Australian talent and actually some fresh talent from overseas back to Australia to build a digital production company that would have longevity. No better way than to have two major films of Kenny Miller Mitchell being Happy Feet 2 and Mad Max 4 to roll up his sleeves and get yourself busy. Pretty awesome. Dr. D, though, speaking of awesome, has got two sister companies, that were two sister relationships that have formed, being Allura for visual effects and animation, and the Lab and, Lab and Digital Pictures, who have partnered together to uh, do technology advancement and the stereoscopic 3D development for Dr. D. And in fact, there's a showcase over there to show you not only how stereoscopic works, but how the guys are seeing the future, the future's here today, for stereoscopic to your household. I'm sure some of you haven't seen that before. So please go out back and check it out. My next case study flows right through from create, service and monetize. Tomorrow in the war began. Some of you might go, what is that? John Marston wrote seven books. Those seven books sold two million copies to the Australian broader um, children, mostly. And we looked at that and went, my goodness. Two million, what an inbuilt audience. Negotiated three years ago to buy the rights to those books and the development began. So a part of the create, create, find director, find writer. In this case, we found the two in one, Stuart Beatty, good friend of mine from school. Uh, he wrote the script on his own just to come forward to try and pitch to get the business. Someone that's written uh, G.I. Joe and Paris the Caribbean isn't normally the one that would go and write on spec to try and pitch for work. But much to our delight, Stuart also wanted to direct. Surrounded him with fantastic Academy Award winning talent and Australia's best and you have yourself a package. Package to finance with our partners, Screen Australia, Screen New South Wales and Paramount and you've got yourself a production. Moving to service. You've got the production through ambience, visual effects and post-production, the lab and corner phase, and corner phase. And monetizing. Again, our partnership with Paramount in distributing the film domestically here and partnering with us in sales internationally. The next case study dubs that web and substation. It's a technology business. Again, it creates services of monetize. Uh, it's a technology for partners on that media and for clients, some of you in this room. But I'll just pick the one best case study, which is WebSend on this occasion, which was an Australian technology business servicing the print industry with, simply put, 
pre-flight services. Sorry, I simplified, but it's best to do that for here. On our beta in the last two years, though, has helped grow that business, and it now licenses the software to VO International in North America and the UK, WebSend in South Africa and across Africa, and now itself is an integrated company through create technology, service technology, and monetized technology. So those bespoke technologies for others like Beyond, where it's able to help monetize its content, etc., is showing that it's a business of its own. The last case study, as I wrap up, is back to the movie network channels. Not only did they entrust the playroom to build the digital media hub, which again I remind you to please just go up to level one, but they entrusted the playroom and Andrew Hogg and his team to develop their online download present. That online presence had the playroom partner with other online app businesses, Botswana and October, to deliver, again, across the create service and help on this occasion a client monetize. And Botswana has also got a display over the back there about augmented reality. Way cool. You need to check it out. So the MNC team, the movie network channels, now have the next step to the future, and a future that Tony keeps driving successfully, and I love, love watching this space. To broaden their distribution channels, to brand extension to online, and more. A further benefit from the movie network channels relationship is the Playroom's relationship into other online businesses, the Lab, Digital Pictures, and October, who have recently launched Swarm Intelligence, which is their digital asset management solution. Again, display out back there. So, as I close, um, there are some showcases of other sorts. I won't list them all, and I haven't been able to mention all our brands, but it just gives you an insight that really we have been able to get ourselves to that space of create, service, and monetize.